this is so exciting, uh, all these different breakthroughs. And I think like a lot of people, I did not know. Most of the communities that I work with, which are communities of color and, and uh, other uh, underrepresented communities, they have no idea. And, and in fact, I would be concerned that if uh, presented with these things, that people would turn away from it because there has been uh, a lot of mistrust uh, from the, because of various experiments and stuff in the medical, from the medical community. Um, you know, people always talk about the Tuskegee affair, but um, there are a lot of different types of things that have gone on, you know, where people have not gotten the proper care. Um, I have a stepfather that I never met because uh, he was misdiagnosed. Uh, he, he was had an appendicitis that uh, ruptured, and he died from that. And and so you have those kinds of things in the going on in the history of the the community. And so when these different um, possible cures and stuff like this come up, uh, people are fearful of them, and 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 that's unfortunate. And um, and also, people need to do research, you know, which means you need to uh, have subjects to come in to be participating in the different uh, research uh, protocols that are there. And so, when you look at, um, you know, the sampling, uh, we're not there. And, and in fact, our genomes <laughs> need to be included in that so that we all get a better understanding of the whole. Um, you know, what it means to be human, and, and, uh, and we're a piece of the puzzle, and we're not there. If we're not part of the conversation, this means that people are making policy where, and, and everybody's uh, coming out of their own experience, you know, which is not my experience or other people's experience. And so there's not the richness there. There's uh, going to be things overlooked. If you're not in a conversation, then you're, you're not there. You don't exist.